Hello my friends and confidants. Here I am today talking about the Silicon Valley Bank default. Yes, you all know about it and it has been on everyone's lips and in everyone's ears in these past days. Now, I will tell you the deep nitty gritty, what you need to know about it, and I will condense it into song for you. Because that's what I do. I make things simplified. And oh, so easy to digest. So, all right, Tom's right. So, anyways, listen. People aren't about this bank promoting homosexuality. And I say, what's wrong with that? What's wrong with gays, right? If people want to suck each other's penises, there's nothing wrong with that. You know, get it in your mouth. Slurp it around, and it's fine. Smack each other on the face with it. It's all well and good, okay? You know, and don't get me started on the on the birds, <laughs> on the ladies. If the ladies want to shag, I mean, <laughs> okay? This is as long as I'm invited, right? <laughs> but here's the thing. Some people say that once you mix politics with your business, you're going to get some dirty results, right? Something that won't wash out. Mm. Yes, it's going to stink for a while. All right? So you look at these folks over at SVB, and we look at their product. What happened? I'll tell you what happened. You're going to want to look at number one, the fact that they defaulted and number two what their practices were now they were focused on having uh, lesbian visibility days and they were focused on uh, you know, gay rights safe spaces in the offices and making sure that people uh, could come out like if they realized that they were gay that they could come out, like there's a special room where they would not be judged and they could come out to everybody and be accepted and get hugs and a slap on the ass, like, good job, you know, like, okay. So that was their priority, but they did not have a, a head of risk assessment. No, they did not have a, a head of risk assessment and what really caused their collapse was uh, they bought uh, a bunch of low-yielding bonds during boom times when it needed to raise funds quickly. And uh, the Fed raised interest rates very aggressively on March 10th. That's, uh, that's, that's what happened. It all cum culminated on March 10th. Okay, seems like they had their minds where they shouldn't have been. They should have been more focused. We could all do with a bit more focus, can't we? Yes, we can. See, who really guides us at the end of the day? Who really pushes us? We think... Our thoughts originate here? <laughs> do they? Or do they originate out there? I mean, who's gotten your thoughts right now? Well, that's a topic for another date. If that interests you, leave a like and subscribe. Here's a banger that's really relevant to this topic and just an awesome song. It's uh, Love to Save the World by 10 Years Later. Check it out.
solution, no solution, institution, electrocution, spread of mind, rich and poor, seminars, stop the war. homosexual like some might want to all right anyways i'll talk to you soon subscribe like this channel and i will be seeing you next week love you all thank you for your support and your love it means the world to me take care of yourself and take care of each other Bye bye